One of the reasons the stock market is doing well is interest rates are very low. One of the reasons interest rates are very low is the general prognosis of the slow recovery. So whenever interest rates are very low, stock market prices are, are often very high. Secondly, businesses have been ruthless in firing workers, uh, pushing down wages. It's good for profits, but not for the overall economy. So the two are really diverging. Um, Wall Street is talking up uh, the recovery because it likes to stale, sell stocks. But I just came back from the American Economic Association meetings in Atlanta, and there the sentiment among the economists was almost universally very pessimistic. Stelis also suggested that the U.S. government may have not have learned any lessons from the financial meltdown. In the United States, we have done nothing about the too big to fail with banks. We have done nothing uh, or almost in uh, very little about the derivatives that cost the American taxpayers $180 billion just in the bailout of AIG. While there may be complacency downtown in Manhattan, in Wall Street, uptown in academia at Columbia, the only question is when is the next crisis going to happen?